teleschool.com learn tele for free hi guys this is rishit cha from tele today we are going to learn how to pass stock market entries in tele it is really very simple and quick and easy to pass stock market entries in tele now there are two types of entries in stock market one is for investment in stock market and second is for business in stock market Today you are going to learn how to pass entries for a business in stock market that is you are doing regular trading in shares. So let's quickly jump onto the voucher by pressing V. So you need to pass journal entries for passing the entries related to stock market as a business. So suppose say if I want to purchase 10 shares of Reliance at a price of 1000 per share. So the entry will be something like this share purchase account this is a share purchase account that i made that the ledger i made under the purchase accounts and set inventory details to yes so it will pop up the menu like this now in this you have to create a reliance named script so let me quickly just show it to you so here it is you have to make the name Reliance under primary units. You have to create number by pressing Alter C number, and that's it. Reliance. So we want to buy 10 shares at a rate of thousand per share. So the total amount is ten thousand. Now there must be a brokerage. So therefore, buy share brokerage. I have already created the share brokerage ledger too under the head direct expenses so let's say on an average the brokerage is 100 rupees and therefore 100 and the total amount goes to show share broker which is one ten thousand and one hundred rupees now press enter the entry is passed now let's see the reflections in the balance sheet first so here it is sundry liabilities that is sundry creditors current liabilities sorry that is 10,100 10, rupees that you owe to the share broker and here it is closing stock of 10,000 and the current loss of 100 rupees on brokerage since I have, have, haven't have passed any other entries it is reflecting the profit and loss it is reflecting loss in the profit and loss account let's quickly jump onto the profit and loss account so here it is let's press alt f1 to see in detail it is a share purchase account 10,000 rupees of shares purchased here is the current entry okay and share brokerage under direct expenses and closing stock of reliance of 10,000 rupees yeah so this is the stock summary it is saying on april month you bought 10 shares of 10,000 value since there are no any other transactions it is directly showing, showing closing stock and a gross loss of 100 as you have to pay the brokerage too now let's quickly jump onto the stock summary here is the stock summary 10 shares 1000 a share bought total value 10,000 rupees closing stock so this was an entry for stock market as a business if you like the video please share it do not forget to subscribe tally school on youtube and give a like on facebook thank you for watching